Hi there, it's Lori, aka Lori Has Hope. And this is Tuesday, September 26th, I think, 2017. And I'm on my weekly trip to Walmart to pick up the groceries I ordered. And I can't see if anybody's coming because <laughs> there's a thing in the way. There we go. Alrighty, here we go. Um, yeah, I tried to check in on my phone, but I didn't get the reminder that we know that it was ready for pickup, so I had to, I just called them, and they said, yeah, it's ready, don't know why you didn't get it, but come on over, so I'm on my way. <laughs> it's a pretty day out here, it's in the low 50s, I don't remember exactly what it is, but I think it's around 52 or 53, somewhere in there, and, uh, yeah, I like the cooler weather. Um, it's actually been really cold when I first wake up in the mornings this last week and I had to turn on the heater. And <laughs> I usually don't turn on the heater until later in the year, but I'm not gonna sit there and freeze. So I turn it on and it's nice and warm and cozy. And since I'm not going to be able to move right now <laughs> I have to resign myself to be as happy as I can where I am and I am grateful that I have a place to live you know that I'm not homeless and I found out that I am not able to be, going to be able to change to a month-to-month -month lease so I'm going to have to sign the year's lease but I'm still going to look for an apartment when the time does come. I know from what the housing authority has told me that I can break the lease it, with the doctor's note. And I've got a living witness who has seen what I've gone through due to the disturbance in the building I live in. So, if, yeah, if I need that, I know she'll stand up for me. <laughs> anyway, I'm also... Um, trying to possibly move within the apartment complex where I'm at. If I can just get out of that building, I think I'll be much happier. Well, I know I will. <laughs> it, no other building could be any louder than the one I'm in now. And I'm hoping to get in one where I can get on an upper floor, the one that has an elevator. All of the buildings that have uh, four levels, four stories, hold on, I've got to open up the trunk here, that's the right thing, there we go, and here they come, so I'll be right back, hold on, I'm back, <laughs> um, got a new guy working here, young guy, young man, very nice, they didn't have my halo top ice cream that I had ordered. I get Halo Top because, as most of you know, it's a lower calorie and lower other stuff ice cream. And I order chocolate because I like chocolate. And they didn't have chocolate, they had mint chocolate or mint chocolate chip or something. And I just, I don't like mint mixed with stuff. I like it separate, but I don't like it in other stuff. It's just like, Reese's. I don't like chocolate and peanut butter mixed together. I like them separate, but not together. <laughs> yes, I, I know. I'm a, one of those. <laughs> but um, anyway, I just told him to that I'd rather not even have the ice cream because... <laughs> and he was, you know, he knew I wasn't being mean. It's just not something I wanted. And so I'd rather just not pay for it. So he took it back and he said, no problem. Just took it off my charge right there before I ever signed. And um, then he went ahead and loaded all my stuff into the trunk. Got me a bunch of new veggies, more Greek yogurt, 1% um, milk for my protein shakes. And I'm in a better mood today. I think it's because I'm not so unsettled. I mean, I'm not able to move, but I know now <laughs> that I'm not moving. So, you know, it's just, it doesn't make me real happy, but I'd rather know for sure 
than to be sitting in limbo, thinking about it and wondering and trying to keep begging my way into where I wanted to go, which wasn't working. Um, and so, as I said before on the way over, I'm going to see about moving into another building here, but I have to find out exactly how to go about that because I was told before that if I move to another building here, I have to start like I'm a brand new tenant, which to me makes no sense because I've lived here almost two years. If I'm just transferring within the complex, I should not have to... Uh, hold on, I'm trying to get myself off the sidewalk so I'm not hanging over there. All right. I'm going to shut that off because it's making too much noise. Um, yeah, if I'm going to transfer within the complex just to another building, hopefully one of the four-story buildings that has an elevator, um, and, and that's what I told them that I prefer. I want to be on an upper floor because I feel it'll be more quiet. Um, I won't hear as much noise coming, you know, from all around. Any building has to be better than this one. Because this one's just, <laughs> as you all know, and you've seen, some of you have seen on Facebook where I had to whine about it a little bit the other day. Um, this one just hasn't really worked out that well for me. So I'll keep you posted on what's going on. I'm waiting now to hear back. And I do most of my communicating with the office through email because due to my anxiety disorder, I do better with email than I do on the phone. If I get on the phone, sometimes I get nervous and I start stuttering and everything. And so if I can just do it in an email, I relax and I, uh, you know, don't have to worry about all that, uh, you know, having an answer to whatever they ask me right away. <laughs> I can think about it. So anyway, I'm just babbling. So it's time for me to go ahead and get my groceries into my apartment, put them away and get on with my day. So I hope you're all doing well. I wish you a wonderful day. Enjoy yourselves, whatever you may be doing. Be safe and remember to keep smiling and keep a PMA. It really does help to keep a positive mental attitude and there is always hope. So I'll talk to you soon. Love you all. Bye.